So why don't we start there? Um, and Dr. Levitt, uh, can you talk about, you've, you've watched the virus, really you started following it in China, and then you looked in Europe, and then in different parts of the United States. Uh, has there been a consistent pattern in how the virus has behaved? Uh, we heard a lot early on about uh, potentially runaway exponential growth of the virus. Uh, has that happened? And um, what would you say about some of these models that were used to really inform a lot of policy in Great Britain and the United States models like Neil Ferguson's model from Imperial College London? Overall, in terms of consistency, I think one of the remarkable things has been just how consistent the behavior of the virus has been. Um, you know, there's two sides to an epidemic. There's the virus and there's the people. And I think that people have been way less consistent than the virus. And that's not surprising because viruses are actually very simple. I mean, they don't, you know, they're, they're very, a little bit of RNA that tries to multiply. It is not a complicated organism. Um, but even in places, I mean, we, we're hearing stories about places that you would have thought would be total disasters having become fine.